Sean Montgomery here standing in front of our Pro 35 X Electrics power box and uh, what I want to do is just do a very quick walk around of the unit, explain it in very uh, brief terms so that we fully understand what we're actually looking at. What we can see here is a P35, Pro 35 and it is equipped with 100 kilowatt hours of battery so you can see that there's five 20 kilowatt hour battery packs mounted on the storage side of the unit and in the front over here at the door that we can see here is containing the power electronics side so what we've equipped this unit with is a 125 amp um, input connection meaning that it would be able to hybridize a diesel generator up to 80 kVA we've also got a 125 amp output, uh, 32 amp output on this side, three phase, and we've also got a couple of different uh, amperage outputs uh, on this side. Over here, we're looking at the at the control panel where we are able to um, put the unit into island mode, into hybrid mode, uh, obviously connected to a diesel generator or a grid and um, this unit's going to be leaving us tomorrow uh, heading over and we'll be hybridizing a diesel generator we'll be in the coming weeks we'll be telling you a little bit more about the functions of the unit um, but what we can see over here is that basically we can be able to plug it into a diesel generator or a grid we take the power from uh, the primary sources uh, put it into the X Electric's power box and then obviously able to combine the power from the primary source with the, the power from the onboard inverter and we come out with peak power boosting functionality. So if the grid is too small or the diesel generator is not able to provide power to let's say additional consumers then that's obviously where X Electric comes in and is able to offer a solution. There are more things that we're able to do. We are able to do uh, island style charging. We're able to provide backup services. We're able to do uh, stabilization of load curves of diesel generators. We're able to do reactive power, power factor correction. Uh, but these are some of the things that we'll be explaining in a couple more videos over the next, next weeks. Thank you very much.